Hey guys, Leanne here. Today I'm in my garage because it's super wet outside. All the snow has been melting off and it's time for Tiny Trick Tuesday. Okay, so for today's Tiny Trick Tuesday, I'm going to try to do a trick that I've done in carpet boarding on my real skateboard. So the trick that I learned on the carpet board is actually half of part of a freestyle trick as far as I'm aware. You guys can let me know in the comments below what this is actually called. But I only know the part where it's already flipped over just as a way to get on the board. So what I want to do today is just try to learn how to do that on my real skateboard with trucks and wheels and see if I can still make that happen. All right, so step one, we just seen, if I can flip it with how heavy it is, it feels okay. Looks like it's going out in front of me a little bit though. I have to tie my shoe. This is very important, my shoe. I've probably been tied the whole time. All right, so let's see. Start it like this. Okay, so this foot stays on. I've got to get this one around after the flipping motion. Okay, so it feels like I can probably do it. Let me just try it one more time here. I think it's about a half of the freestyle trick called the Casper, but I'm not certain. Okay. Okay. So that's about what I want to be doing on the real skateboard. Let's see. Stand it with the one foot and put the other foot down. Shoe is untied again. All right. Oh, let's see if I can do this. Okay. So I can keep my foot up off the ground afterwards, maybe that'll help me to get it back in place. I know I've got this, I'm just wimping out on landing on the board. Oh, okay. <laughs> one more, one more, we totally got this. Oh! <laughs> I gotta get my momentum forward so I can land on it. Oh! So close, so close! one. Let's get them a little bit better and then I'm gonna get the carpet out of here and see if I can still do it. Oh. Yeah, I gotta make sure I have them down more solid and balanced before I take the carpet out of here or otherwise I'm just gonna fall. <laughs> that one didn't get around all the way. There we go. <laughs> Still a little bit of fear there, so I'm worried about taking away the carpet. Alright. Let's take the carpet away and see if I've still got this. I'm thinking the first one is gonna be my best shot just doing it without thinking about it. Oh <laughs> still freaked me out. I can do this, I can do this. I think I've got it in three tries. Three, let's see. Ugh, two, I gotta get forward and get over the board. Ugh. Okay, so I lied about the three tries. This trick is called the, uh, oh look, your shoes are untied now. That's what we're gonna name it. <laughs> it's still just so terrifying to me to have the board flipping underneath me. It just seems like so much can go wrong. That was a pretty fast one. So I think that's about as good as it's gonna get. Um, I'm getting pretty tired. I am gonna do a few more tries and see if I can get it down on the concrete. If it doesn't work out, it doesn't work out, we will get that next time. All right, let's see if we can land a couple of these. Oh, look at this. Oh my 
gosh. Check this out. I check out my laces. I finally ripped right through them doing this trick. They had been frayed and now they are totally torn in half. Woo! I'm gonna have to relace these bad boys. These shoes still have some more life in them, but the laces are wrecked. Sweet. All right, let's keep going. Let's see if we can get this thing down. super stoked I got it down on the concrete. So again, let me know what that's called in the comments below. I believe it's a freestyle trick called a Casper and that I am only doing about half of it. But um, let me know if there's another name for it. I hope you guys enjoyed watching and I will see you guys next week. Hey, so I wanted to add in a thank you real quick. I looked at my channel and I have gone over 300 subscribers and that just absolutely blows my mind. I haven't said thank you for that since 200 I believe. So the new over a hundred of you that decided to watch my content and like it enough to subscribe, thank you guys so, so much. It just absolutely blows my mind, completely makes my day. Every time you guys leave nice comments and talk to me below, please do that. I would love to comment back. Um, that's one of my favorite things is coming in and seeing that you guys enjoy the content or just had fun watching or laughed at any of the silly little things that I edited in. So again, thank you guys so much. The other big crazy milestone that I wasn't expecting is my channel has almost reached 10,000 total views on the videos. So thank you so much to each and every one of you guys who watch these videos. I appreciate you more than words can express. So again, just thank you so, so much. And I will see you guys next week. Bye.